Next, 112 pounds, Juan Carlos Garcia. Terrytown, hometown, Sleepy Hollow High School in section one. He's only a junior. 32 and two against Keith Segura out of East Meadow High School in East Meadow, section eight on Long Island. He's a senior, 31, four and one. 112 pound New York State Championship bout and they're getting set to go. Official Norm Thomas, Dave Adams will be his assistant as they are set to go. Garcia in the blue, Segura in the green. Juan Carlos Garcia, a junior. His opponent, Segura, a senior. Oh, Segura in a little bit of trouble as Garcia now gets two right there. Nice first move, Dale. Underhook. Garcia through an underhook. Then into a single leg, or close to a double leg for the two points. But this action is so quick, it's tough to keep track of how, what move is thrown. They change in midair. That's right. Can't wait for the heavyweights when it slows down a little <laughs> bit here. Garcia chooses to let Segura up, gives up one point, goes right back after him. That field same is, move, did, did not complete it. Very confident, obviously, on his feet, John. Yeah, I remember that from last year when he was in the state championships. He was pretty tough on his feet. You mentioned that. He was second in the states last year at 105. He likes to play football. He's 112. Last year, 105. Juan Carlos Garcia. Well, they grow mean in Sleepy Hollow. <laughs> Section one, the second in the States, 1989. And Segura, as we said, out of East Meadow, wants to go to Cortland. He's 31, four and one. Lots of times, some of these losses will come on upper weights. Uh, they'll go up a couple of weights sometimes. and. That's right, Dale. The end of the season, they dropped down to their uh, optimal wrestling weight. Shed all that baby fat. Oh, move and counter. Move and counter. A lot of great moves thrown in counters. Yep. And nothing in that flurry. Segura gets his Chairman. headgear adjusted. That happens so much when you have two very talented wrestlers out there. Lock up, Garcia, both guys now know what to expect a little bit more. 13 seconds left in the period. Good upper body great, move. Great duck under, brought him to the mat for the two points. I thought Garcia was gonna throw, an upper body throw, but he settled to just bring Segura down to the mat. You know, I think the way they've been going and the counters that Segura's been making, he's probably smart to get his points. He maybe could have gotten uh, rolled through himself. You're so right, Dale. Right there, he's picked up two. It's 4-1. With a throw, with a throw you're, not, you're not sure who's going to come up on top. On top in the score is Juan Carlos Garcia, 4-1 out of section one. Keith Segura, his opponent, is in a little bit of trouble. Up and down. Boy, that was a great move. Very fast. Spear shot in. Garcia countered, then reshot in and got the two points. You know, you, you kind of get the idea that Garcia is relentless and we're going to get a little injury time. Segura knows. Got hit. While we got a second, I want to let you know the rights to this cable cast have been granted by the New York State Public High School Athletic Association, representing 778 senior high schools across the state and the more than 500,000 boys and girls who participate annually in this sponsored athletic competition. Any rebroadcast or republication of the programming without the written consent of this organization is strictly prohibited. And that out of the way, we're right back to wrestling. And fortunately, Segura was not hurt. At this stage of the game, unless something breaks, you're not really, not hurt, That's I guess. That's right, we've seen him walk out there where normally you'd, you'd get a wheelchair. That's right, tape and casts and not right. casts, but have lots to of finish. tape. The whole season is on the line, and you gotta finish it. Garcia behind, uh, tight waist, now he's got the arm. Waist control, and they're gonna go out of bounds. 6-1 the score, Garcia on top of Keith Segura. Second period underway, 124 left in the second period. Kick off, 
Stand up, trying to get control of the arms of Garcia. Garcia has to break when he comes down. He does. Oh, he's going to call a, a lot. No. One point. Escape. So that will give a point to Segura. 6-2. Yeah, Garcia wasn't working on top. Uh, Segura down, down below with a great hand control. Took his time. Got his one point. Well, there's a shoot and counter again. Really doing a lot of pushing and shoving, looking for an opening. Unusual for lightweights. 112 yeah. pounders usually just shooting it whenever they want. Now we're getting that tie up more and more. A tie up, a little faint, trying to post the head, trying to shrug him Garcia by, drag him by. Good trick. He gets a takedown. Now he's working that arm bar. Smooth, isn't he? Very slick, for especially for a junior. You know, th this type of wrestling, you expect a, a college junior to, to be uh, showing you, but not a high school junior. Well, we mentioned he was second in the States last year at 105. He's up to 112 this year, so you expect that he's got some moves, but you're right, he does wrestle older, perhaps. He's only a junior, and he was a second last year, so he's on top now by 8-2. No, out to the side using that. Still doesn't have that good hand control. A lot of movement there, but not a lot of moves being thrown. And that's the way it's going to end. No moves, no points. At that last flurry, score remains 8-2 in favor of Juan Carlos Garcia, Keith Segura. His opponent from Section 8 has got six points to make up in two minutes. And he wants top. Segura takes top. Maybe a little unusual. The last period, he's got six points to make up, and he's going to be on top. Not a good position unless you're a, a great pinner, and it doesn't seem to be from this angle that uh, he was. He gave up an escape, 9-2 now. He gave up an escape quickly to Garcia. Garcia up in about eight seconds, and now they're right back where they have been a lot of this out on their feet, John. This is where uh, Juan Garcia is very comfortable. We've seen him with three takedowns already. Nice move by Segura. The first attempt that he's been in deep, but he didn't finish it off, and the head was not out to the side. Oh, look, not a desperation move yet, but close to it. I thought well, it was going to cost him some points. Well, great, great shrug by Garcia. Luckily for uh, Segura, he was close to the out of bounds. No takedown. Segura down by seven, nine to two, as this 109, excuse me, 112 pound bout winds down. We're in the last period, 110 left. 110, and that's a lot of points to make up, especially with the pace that this bout has been going and the way that Garcia has been controlling it. be the last chance for Segura to win a state championship. He is a senior. Great crowd here tonight, by the way, John. The whole place is packed. Not many. In fact, I couldn't find a seat in here. The seat was easy. Uh, the parking down here was a little tough. That's right. <laughs> this afternoon. Nice move, but once again, out of bounds. We're well under a minute, 41 seconds, as you can see in the insert. Segura, very, very hard pressed to do much against Juan Carlos Garcia in the blue. It's moving down to crunch time too, Dale. 25 seconds left in the match. He's got a home run move right now. He better throw it. You know, Garcia's 32 and two. I don't know who the two guys that beat him. They might be here somewhere at a different weight, I guess. Boy, that's a. <laughs> he must have been mugged. There yes. had to be more than one of them. Very smooth, takes him up, brings him down easy to the mat, garners two more points. 11 to two, lets him up, 11 to three. Shooting in on that double leg. Good takedown artist, and Segura tries to switch, but two points at the end is gonna give Garcia a 13 to three win. 
Nice job by Juan Carlos Garcia, New York State champ, and he's only a junior. And he's very, very happy about that. Great job by Garcia. Take a look at that uh, shot in on a double leg. Garcia lifts him up. Very gently though, he didn't slam him to the mat, gets a two point control. If he had control of the upper body, could have got some back points. Great job, moved to 119.